Hello everyone and welcome to another Friday new product post here at SparkFun Electronics. As you can see, we are still at the new building. We have not yet been kicked out or burned it to the ground. This is the front desk. This is where you would come to pick up your local orders if you select a local pickup. And in the next couple weeks, we'll be showing you various parts of the building until we have a nice formal walkthrough of the new building. You may be asking yourself, bro, do we even lift? Totes. We're here in the SparkFun Fitness Room, and this is the climbing wall, which has our next new product, the MicroView Bootloading Kit. The MicroView Bootloading Kit consists of several different components. It consists of an AVR programmer, scalpel, some resistors, and some jumper wire. In addition to this, we also have a guide on the website that shows you how to crack open the MicroView, access the programming headers, and either change the bootloader or load one of the bootloaders onto a MicroView. Here we have one of the assembled kits to give you an idea of what it looks like when you can program the MicroView. Here we've got a MicroView opened up and you can see where the jumpers connect into to access the programming pins. If you check out the tutorial linked on the MicroView bootloading page, you can not only see how to load a bootloader on any AVR programmer, but you can also see how to load a bootloader specifically on your MicroView. Let's talk about the breakout board for the LTC4150 Cool Ohm counter. Now, a Cool Ohm is a unit of charge. It describes the amount of charge that's transported by a constant current of one amp for one second. Now, why do you need to know Cool Ohms? Well, Say you have a battery and you know what the capacity of that battery is. For example, this battery, which has a capacity of 110 milliamp hours. That means it can supply 110 milliamps over the course of an hour. And if you know that the battery is fully charged and you know how much charge is leaving the battery in coulombs, then you know how much battery power is left in your project and you can budget the amount of power that your project's using. The cool thing about this breakout board is that it'll actually measure charge in both directions and tell you which direction the charge is going. So if you're charging the battery back up through the Coulomb counter, it can actually tell you how much charge is going into the battery and then add to the amount of power that it's measuring in the battery. This is a simple example uh, by our engineer, Mike Grusin, who actually did the layout for this breakout board. And all it's doing is measuring the amount of uh, charge that's leaving this little battery that's powering the whole thing. You'll hear it beep maybe once every 15 seconds. That's when it's getting an interrupt from the uh, Coulomb counter board. Now, Coulomb counter board works by throwing an interrupt uh, every time that it measures 0.614 coulombs. Because of the uh, because of the current consumption of this project, it probably won't beep but every 15 seconds or so. And as it's doing that, knowing that the battery was at full charge when I turned it on, it's subtracting the amount of charge that's coming out of the battery and telling you a percentage of how much charge is left in the battery. So right now we're at about 90%. <laughs> oh, classic Nick. Those were your new products for this week. I'll leave you here up on the roof of the new SparkFun building, and we'll see you again next week with even more new products and a little bit more of the new building. See you then.